what is poppin' of course what's going on baby what's poppin' of course look it is scorpion red tarot i am back at it yet again to let y'all know what the fuck is going on for the month of april 2019 yes indeed yes i am yes i am yes i am okay of course shout out to all my new subscribers how you be how you doing what's up what's vibing okay so listen if you guys want to book a personal private reading y'all can go ahead click the hyperlink on the about tab that says scorpion red tarot at simply book me and again then it says scorpion red tarot at simply book me if this video resonates at any point in time and you want to put a proper dropper you want to drop a a dollar a two or three you know all up in the PayPal, you can go ahead and do that, you know. <laughs> Let the spirit move you. Let the spirit behoove you. Okay, girl? All right, man? All right, friend? Okay? The link is in the description. Y'all just go ahead and let your fingers go ahead and move on over there and just go ahead and click that link. Go ahead, go ahead and do it. Go ahead, go ahead. Anyway, so listen. Of course. Of course. Let's get it to the energies. Father God, thank you so much for bringing. Y'all know, of course, that those my best friends. That's my best friends. That's my best friend in them. Y'all know, of course, don't be for it. Y'all know, of course, do not be for it. That's my, like, kindred sister or son. Like, that's my friend. That's my... Okay, I'm sorry, Father. You know, I, you know, I just had that in my moment with a, a quirk. Okay. I'm going to shut up. Okay, listen, Father, listen. Father, okay? We feeling good. We all up in the hood. You understand what I'm saying? We, we ain't playing. We ain't delaying. I don't know. Of course, why y'all got me acting silly? Because I wasn't, I wasn't like this just a second ago. Okay, whatever. Father, it's a chorus for listen, just give us guidance because I don't even know why they got me acting retarded right now. Like, a chorus like to have fun when we get down. Like, you know, they like, listen, when you get to our video, we <laughs> we like to have a good fucking time. I don't know what them other motherfuckers be doing over there, but oh, sorry, Father. See, listen, I'm getting beside myself. Aquar Father, give Aquarius guidance because they be having me out of pocket. Okay, Father, stop. Let me stop. I'm just going to stop while I'm ahead. Father, please give a. <laughs> Give Aquarius God listen, Father, give Aquarius guidance for April. Cause we we not even about to do this because Aquarius about to get me in trouble. See, this is why I can't hang around Aquarius is when I go to the club with an Aquarius, honey, we shut down the place. We shut down the bomb Listen me. What? Don't let me and my Aquarius friends get a good cocktail. <laughs> what? <laughs> Y'all don't fuck it. Uh-huh. Listen, Aquarius, I feel like, listen, y'all excited. Y'all like, this my season for a reason, bitch, okay? Like, y'all love the springtime, okay? Y'all look like, let's get it popping. What's popping? What's popping? What's popping? What's popping? What's popping for a quote? Ooh, ooh, ambition and mistakes. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Father, what? Father, tell me what Aquarius been doing. You can tell me. You can tell me what Aquarius been doing for us, okay? We just gonna have a little talk, that's all. We just gonna have a little talk. Let's take a long walk around the park after... Aquarius, you been in the park after the... Aquarius! Aqu Aquarius! Uh-uh! No, because I know y'all, y'all, ooh, y'all, ooh, Aquarius. Who you been in the park at the dark with, Aquarius? Mmm. Did you make a mistake, Aquarius? Did you get caught in the park? Aquarius, what you was doing? Mm, 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 mm. Y'all had a little lewd exposure moment. Ooh. Who was getting some? <laughs> Let me shut up. Let me shut my mouth. Let me shut my mouth. Ambition. May I offer all of my deepest longings to love itself and invite a divine plan beyond my mind's imagination. Please use me for the highest good. Come on, Father. Mistakes. Allow me to know that it's okay to make mistakes. Let me always take care of the inner child so that he or she feels loved no matter what. That's why y'all got me acting so silly. And I feel like like y'all are so... Okay, Aquarius, listen. Somebody been taking a long walk in the park after dark. And I feel like y'all was out there acting silly. And y'all might have made a little mistake. I feel like somebody might have got like a public intoxication 
type of thing. Like y'all was being real ambitious out there. Y'all was having fun. You know what I'm saying? And y'all was really enjoying yourself because it's like I'm free. I'm being me. Like I'm doing like what? Why I can't what? You know, I'm a fucking rebel. Like I I feel like I want to go to these cars first. <laughs> I feel like I want to go to the bonfire deck and y'all a rebel right there. Like, y'all look like, listen, I was just having fun. Like, I just made a little fucking mistake. Okay, so what? Whatever. I was just trying to let my inner child shine through. Okay, what you want to do? Okay? Y'all mad because of, <laughs> y'all mad because I be great? Because <laughs> I'm out here being great and playing my life being free? Because I'm ambitious? Tuh. Tuh. Y'all big mad out here. Okay? Allow me to make mistakes. Okay? I'm enjoying my inner child. <laughs> she feel, she or he feel love no matter what. Y'all talking about fuck y'all. <laughs> Aquarius, why y'all so big? The tennis wars. Oh, mm, but the ace of cups. Come on now. Okay. Aquarius on some rebel shit. They already starting off like bow, bow, bow. Like what? Bow, bow, boom, bow, shapow. Who like me now? Like, nigga, you stabbed me in my back. You betrayed me. Okay, you thought you slayed me. You thought you played me, but you didn't delay me. You didn't delay a damn thing. Why monkey don't stop no show? <laughs> what you thought this was? Only thing you did was make me ambitious to go on here and get, get, get it. Like, what you thought we was doing, honey? Yes, I made a mistake with you, indeed. Boy, you better sip, sip, sip. Hold on, come on. Brown liquor, brown liquor, brown air. Ah, come on, Solange. Come on, Solange. Listen. Shh. Blackberry the masses. <laughs> the world. You're not going to stop my world, baby. You're not going to stop my world. You thought you was coming through. You thought you was going to slay me. You didn't delay me, baby. But you going to pay me. <laughs> You going to fucking pay up, cause bitch, I stay up. I stay up. You go I'm about to write that down. You gonna pay up cause I stay up. Okay? My ambition stay up. Let me write that down. Hold on, y'all. I'm sorry, y'all. Hold on. Mm-mm. Mm -mm, I had to write that down because I can't forget that. Because you're not going to stop. You're not going to stop Aquarius world for nothing. <laughs> you're not. And it's like, I keep trying to tell people, when people show you their true colors and they show you who they are, be thankful for those mistakes. Allow me to know it's okay to make mistakes. Let me take care of the inner child so that he or she feels love no matter what. Like, no matter what. Like, Aquarius is love. Aquarius is fucking good. Like, if anything, this shit right here, thank you for killing that old me that needed to be dead and gone because I ain't like that bitch anyway. Or I ain't like him anyway. Okay? You helped me shed some skin. Thank you. All right? All right? So I give I gave enough of my mental time and my energy to the love in the situation of the past. It don't matter if this was a love situation. It don't matter if you were being betrayed by a friend or someone at work, whatever. But someone just did you over so much that it wasn't even no more room in your back for them to put another goddamn sword. Like, it was like, how much more were you going to do? But at the end of the day, you didn't do anything. <laughs> you didn't do. You made me more ambitious. You taught me how to still go out there and fucking love and still how to get it. And don't let nobody motherfucker stop you. Don't let no. You might have stalled my world a little bit, but bitch, I'm still moving. What? Only thing I got to do is change the tire. What? Tuh. I'm a sale hire. I'm going regardless of what. The four wands. Only thing I had to do is divorce you and get you, get this dead wake up off my carriage. Okay, because you fat, you lazy, you nasty, you trifling. You was putting too much pressure on my motherfucking struts and my goddamn. <laughs> you was, your fat, ugly ass was putting too much motherfucking pressure on my shocks and my struts, bitch. You was weighing my carriage down. You had to get the fuck up out of here, bitch. Fuck out of here. The Ace of Wands. It's new beginnings popping off around this bitch. Fuck wrong with y'all. 
What is wrong with these people, y'all? Why they be I be keep trying to listen? That's why I love coming through Aquarius. Aquarius already know how we go. Aquarius already know. We wear unicorns around this bitch. We don't be with this fuck shit. We do not be with it. We do not be with it. Please give me the general energy for Aquarius. What? What? This is where unicorn puss, okay? We sprinkling motherfucking magical unicorn dust around on y'all hoes. What? Y'all be waiting for a motherfucker like me to come around. Huh? What? What? About to dance on y'all hoes, okay? Doodle brown. What? Y'all hoes mad because I'm motherfucker out here having fun. Yes, the party has just begun. Yes. The party start when I slide through. And I thought you knew. Hmm? Dance, honey. Bala. Dance. Bala. Movements. Bala. Okay? Move your body to music. Dance with the rhythm of life. Manifest your dreams through dance. Keep going out and partying. So what? You made the mistake and you got a goddamn D <laughs> a DUI or whatever the fuck it was. I don't know what the hell. You got caught in a park smoking some weed. You got pulled over goddamn drinking. I don't know what it was, but it wasn't nothing that damn serious. That's going to really stall your world or for anything that's happening. Like, no. Your heart is full of love. Your heart is full of passion. You are ambitious. Like... Aquarius, you are like so happy. Your spirit is like legitimately like I feel like I'm on speed or something like that. <laughs> like for real, your intentions. Be clear of your decisions. Focus on what you really want. Be bold with your request to the universe. And I honestly truly feel like Aquarius is like really trying to achieve some real bold shit right now. And it, and it is literally just enjoying my life and not giving a single solitary fuck about none of y'all bitches. And that's bold enough because a lot of y'all motherfuckers give too much of a fuck about what somebody else goddamn think. Okay? And too worried about some past life bullshit. Fuck that shit. <laughs> past lives. Release your past life karma. You... Or an old soul with deep wisdom. Yeah, that ain't that an Aquarius, okay? Healing your past life will raise your vibrations. That's why you are so free right now. Like, listen, that is why y'all are so free. Like, literally, this person stabbing you in your back, doing the shit that they did, did the best fucking thing for you. And the only thing right now, you just made a fucking dumbass mistake being out here having fucking fun because you feel fucking free and amazing. You feel amazing, of course. Of course. Okay? Of course, say it with me. These hoes big man. They big mad that Aquarius, their attentions is very clear out there. They dancing and they enjoying life. And as they in, listen, listen to me, Belinda. Belinda, what you remember? Belinda, what you remember, Belinda? Listen. Oh, I said, don't let it all hang out. And watch what you say. Ooh, ooh, what you talking about, um, Aquarius? This is for the ones that's in a relationship. Don't let it all hang out. And let's leave some to the imagination. Oop, of course. Ooh, of course. Y'all been, ooh. Ooh, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Like, some of y'all got caught up doing something in a, like, some indecent, exp, exp, I said indecent proposure. <laughs> indecent exposure or something like I feel like maybe y'all just been dressing real raunchy. Like, y'all be going to the club. Y'all know, like, how y'all be having them little kind of sheer outfits where y'all basically be walking around in a bra and the panties, like, type of thing like that. And, like, maybe a club is like, look, bitch, you can't come in here dressed like that. Okay? You cannot come in here dressed like that. And watch what you say. That mouth of yours is, uh, could start some shit. <laughs> <laughs> that mouth of yours could start some shit. Aquarius. So I feel like for the Aquarius that um I don't necessarily feel like this is someone that is in like a real strong committed relationship. Because for whatever reason, I feel like Aquarius, the word commitment, I feel like the word commitment in Aquarius, it just does not like Aquarius Aquarius be like, huh? Uh, what? Who? Who, what? Uh, let me clean. What? Uh-uh. Do I know you like that? What? 
who you want me to show what you mean you want me to show emotions and be committed and, and be affectionate to you every day type shit oh no you might want to find somebody else for that shit i don't know i don't know if i'm cut out for that it's something about relationships that aquarius be like uh <laughs> mistake <laughs> boy please mm -mm, aquarius ain't on that shit right now their world is moving and changing. They're closing chapters. They're like, fuck some love type of shit. Motherfuckers done stabbed me in my back for the last time. Please give me some guidance for the singles. For the single singles. The single single singles. Ooh. Ooh. Fuck apologizing. See, Aqu y'all be... <laughs> Aquarius, y'all be going too hard. It says some good shit is about to happen and you are loved. Okay, Aquarius. Listen, listen me, Aquarius. I ain't got time to be fucking with you. Can I be an Aquarius? I just want to be a badass motherfucker like y'all. I just want, can I be it? What? Fuck apologizing to people. Okay, fuck apologizing. Whatever you want to do, seriously, just do it. Fuck these people. Set your intentions. Be clear and decisive. Focus on what you really want and be bold with your request to the universe. Fuck apologizing for being who you are and doing what you want to do. Whatever you want to do, seriously, just do it. Fuck these people, okay? Because something real good is about to come to your life. Don't let your issues fuck it up, okay? Sure. I don't know what issues they talk about. Ooh, 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 ooh. Aquarius, ooh. Aquarius, what you, ooh. Mm, mm. Probably that goddamn spiciness y'all in that goddamn mouth. <laughs> Spirit wants you to know that you are loved. You are here for a reason. Don't fuck it up. I feel like this. I feel like this whole you guys being in this moment of y'all just being single right now. I feel like y'all are here for a reason. And it's just like fuck being apologetic to people, you know, about the decisions that you're making and the things that you would, however you decide to move your life right now, you decide to move your life like that because you want to fucking move your life like that. And it's like, I'm not fucking apologizing to nobody for being me and doing what the fuck I want to do. Fuck y'all. You know what I'm saying? Because you might not get it, but I get it. You know? So, sure. And something real good about to come to you because you will love, you know? And like I said, a lot of times it's meant for people to be single because when blessings start coming to you, it ain't meant for other people to be around you. Because it ain't meant for them. It's meant for you and only you. Please give me guidance for this. Um, singles. I'm saying singles in my head. Singles. Y'all don't feel like playing around with people right now. You not. You don't feel like playing around right now. You don't see. You, you're not. You don't see anybody that, that, that you consider a true love. Or somebody that you would even remotely like consider. Like, really giving your time and attention to, like, to, you're not playing around with people. You don't have time for this shit. Like, you're like, I'm too grown for this shit. I'm tired of making mistakes. I'm very ambitious. I want something new, true, and blue. I need something amazing in my life. And if you ain't a showstopper, like, for real, for real, I'm not about to stop my world from you. I'm just going to continue to keep going out there having fun. I'm not going to keep giving people opportunities to keep stabbing me in my back and doing all this fuck shit. Like, nah, I'm good. Like, I'm not pressed for love. Like, <laughs> like I feel Aquarius, like, out of all of the signs, Aquarius is one of the signs that is truly very, very, very secure in who they are. They know who they are. They're not going to change or allow anyone to feel like they need to manipulate themselves. They know who they are and they're very comfortable in their skin and they don't give a fuck. Like, they'll rather be alone. Like, they're good. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. Whoever you're dealing with, you know it's not your soulmate. I really think that you're just playing around with this person because they remind you of someone from your past life. But this person from your past life was an asshole too. Y'all just have a lot of good chemistry with each other. Okay? But I feel like don't move too fast. Don't let it all hang out. And just watch what you say. Watch your mouth. You know what I'm saying? Like, because I feel like your mouth can get you into a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? Especially, like, if y'all out having a good time. Like, don't, be careful. Don't be out there getting drunk. Getting into arguments and shit with motherfuckers. Because you, you and your little feisty ass little goddamn mouth and shit like that. Because that might not be attractive, Aquarius. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't make that mistake. And, yeah, you know. So, 
please give me some additional guidance for the Aquariuses that are single for the month of April. Dark Knight of the Soul. I feel like in regards to y'all need to like it's something that y'all really it's not nothing more to say. The dark night of the soul. You guys need to like really dig deep and go deep within and figure out like what it is and why y'all don't want to be in relationships. Like I feel like for these ones over here that are single, they've been single for a long time and they like being single. Like they don't want to be in a fucking relationship. They like relationship what? What no fucking relationship? And I ain't apologizing about that shit. I don't fucking want to be with nobody like that. I want. You gotta fucking listen to somebody every fucking day. I don't want that shit. <laughs> like, that's how I feel. Like, why y'all look fucking hilarious anyway? So, I feel like in this situation with this person, these people that are dating, like, you know that there's a third party, and you know you, you know that there's a third party in this situation, but you don't give a fuck about this union for real. Like, you're just playing around with this person. You're not compromising in this situation at all. You know, you're focused on your healing. And I feel like at this time, like, you know that the situation that you're, that you're dealing with and this person that you're dealing with, they're really blocking your healing process. But I feel like right now, it's just like, I feel like some, it, some people just need sex as like a, a release, like almost like, it's just like, I know I'm dealing with somebody that got somebody else or this I'm dating and this person is dating other people and shit like that. And I, I can see that this ain't going nowhere. But sometimes people just fuck just to get some tension off or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like Aquarius know like there is something going on where they're just really unawakened about something. There is something. It's something that they need to. Be alone and be by their self and kind of just kind of contemplate and think about. I feel like it's something that you need to wake up. Like, it's like you need to wake up because I feel like you're not healing. And I feel like y'all are just. It's like, you know, why even entertain, even mix yourself up in a situation where you know that there's a third party just to be doing something. You know what I'm saying? Like. You know that this person reminds you of some bullshit in your past, but y'all just have good chemistry. So it's just like, whatever. Like, I really don't. I mean, because you don't want this union. You don't want this union. And I feel like, you know, right now that you you feel like the person that you're dealing with is unawakened. You know, and it's something that is waking up inside of you. And it's like you, you're, you're getting to the point where you're almost not wanting to communicate with this person because you feel like your love life is ascending. It's ascending. And I feel like it moved really fast. It moved really fast. And that's why spirit is like, really with the next one, just don't tell people too much. Because I feel like you might have told somebody something about something that you did or something that you went through and experienced in your past that might have made them felt like that you would be okay or accepted to this third party type of shit and it's just like honestly you're not and you know you're not that unawakened like that anymore like you're ascending to a higher place you know and it's just like i don't even know why i told that person that shit i feel like this relationship moved real fast it's a lot of chemistry there, but you remind me of that bullshit in the past. Like, I don't, I ain't necessarily feeling this shit. I'm not, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Like, you really not tripping over this union at all. Like, Aquarius just don't be fucking tripping. Like, they just, like, I wish I had that inner Aquarius where I just don't be tripping on shit. Because I do. I be like, what? Motherfucker. What motherfucker? Anyway, so give me some heart chakra balancing information for my couples for April for Aquarius. Thank you so much. What just popped out right there? Manifesting. All right. So right now, I feel like you need to work on manifesting 
exactly what you want like really have clear intentions like if you don't want these people that remind you of anything from the past think about everything but those type of elements that you you know that whatever that is just you need to change your wording instead of saying like and this was in the neck this was in the reverse so what i'm saying i feel like you're negatively manifesting and i feel like you're not doing it right i feel like instead of telling the universe and telling god like i am a queen i am only inviting someone into my life that is loyal someone that is hard working um I am loving, I am deserving of love, like, instead of you, like, speaking prosperity and abundance into your life, you're like, I don't want to be with someone that's doing this, well, I don't want this, and I don't want that, and woo, 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 and I feel like that's negatively manifesting, and I feel like, like, the universe and God is sending you more of these things that you say that you don't want to see if you really don't want it or is you still going to entertain it. You see what I'm saying? So, don't manifest in that way. Only tell and only speak blessings over your life, you know? And I feel like that's the thing that you're unawakened about. It's like in your throat chakra, okay? And for the singles, the dark night of the soul, I feel like your throat chakra, okay? You guys have a big time dealing with challenge and just change and, and adapting to new different situations. I feel like as soon as y'all feel something change, y'all are just, y'all are not as daring and just quick witted and just able to kind of go with the flow. Y'all just be like, what? Okay, whatever, bye. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all not able to communicate and let people know how y'all are feeling and things like that i feel like y'all are rather op walk away than just open up emotionally on that type of level you know what i'm saying where you're able to communicate your emotions and i feel like y'all almost scared to be that vulnerable and tell people and show people how you feel and like that's something that you really battle with on the inside that's that dark night of the soul. Like, I really battle with that on the inside. And I feel like you, you like, if you cuss to someone out, you can tell someone how you feel. But when it comes to matters of the heart and love, I feel like you don't want to show people your vulnerability. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, Spirit, please give me some clarification. For my singles, and then we up out of here. Please give me some clarification for my single Aquariuses. Thank you so much, Paul. Eight of Cups. Yeah. Y'all just rather walk away instead of you guys. Expressing your emotions and telling people how you feel, you just get frustrated. Just be like, you know what, whatever, fuck it, bye. Like, fuck apologizing. Like, what does it say? Fuck apologizing. Like, what am I apologizing for? I don't have to tell you how I feel. Like, I'm fucking leaving. Fuck y'all. <laughs> hey, bro, y'all funny as shit. And for um the couples, the six of cups. In the reverse, I feel like you guys are so stuck on the damn past. It's like, it's not allowing you to really ascend. I feel like y'all keep attracting the same type of unwanted type of individuals. You know what I'm saying? It reminds you of, of people in the past because of your language, like the things that you're saying. Watch your mouth. You know what I'm saying? Watch the things that are coming out of your mouth because it could get you in a lot of trouble because I feel like maybe you guys may be even praising someone in the past because of their sex skills. Like maybe some of the middle quartz is like, man, shit, I know Brittany. Remember Brittany from back in motherfucking high school? Like, yeah, that bitch was a fucking whore, but god damn, like that bitch got some motherfucking neck on her, boy. That bitch gets a good ass like I don't know like I feel like you guys be doing shit like that and it's like maybe y'all be talking the things that you talk about in the good like are not necessarily things that are good for you you know what I'm saying and even when you're manifesting when you're manifesting and you're talking about what it is that you want to the universe you 
more so talk about put more energy in the things that you don't want versus the things that you do want and it confuses the universe because they don't know what to give you because you put too much energy on the negative things versus the positive things you know what i'm saying and you really have to work hard at letting this past go because this past is holding you back and you keep attracting the same shit in a different toilet Okay, so Aquarius, I love you. I hope that this gave you some insight and some clarity, my dears. I do, and I do, and I do love you. If this video resonates, y'all go ahead and hit that like button. Um, if you're new to the page, if you liked my energy, and if I gave you some insight, hit that subscribe button. And if you would like to book a personal and private reading with Scorpion Red Tarot, you can do so by clicking that About tab on my YouTube page. There's a hyperlink at the bottom that says Scorpion Red Tarot at Simply Book Me. Again, it's Scorpion Red Tarot at Simply Book Me. Thank you so, so much. If you want to give a love donation, if it gave you insight and clarity, or if I just made you laugh and you had a good ass time with me, because I damn sure had a good ass time with you all right shout out to everybody in the chat i love you guys so much thank you so much for your love and support i will see you guys in the mid-month peace